Cigna is now passing 20 meters and approaching the International Space Station. Houston Station on two for Robo. We're at 15 meters. No change in Black Bravo. Copy all, Peggy. Cygnus now closing in on 13 meters away from the International Space Station. Uh, you can see clearly both solar, uh, ultra-flex solar arrays and the cross pins that Peggy Whitson and Thomas Pesquet aboard the International Space Station at the Cupola Workstation. Controlling the station's robotic arm, uh, you can see the three-pronged crosshairs there that will guide them uh, into its uh, capture point. So confirmation from Peggy Whitson that um, uh, Cygnus is holding at 12 meters away from the International Space Station, still within the capture limits. Uh, flight controllers here now uh, assessing a go, no go for capture. Uh, capture sequence is initiated. Uh, hopefully the uh, Cygnus will be captured just in about two or so minutes. Station's robotic arm moving closer uh, to its uh, capture position. Just about four meters away now. One meter away from capture. robotic arm over the pin. Trigger initiated and snares closed. And snares are closed, confirmed capture right on time, 5.05 a.m. Central Time, 6.05 a.m. Eastern. Station's robotic arm now uh, starting the first of its procedures, beginning to move uh, the Cygnus cargo vehicle into the first of its uh, berthing positions. There are some experiments that will remain on Cygnus until it departs, uh, now currently scheduled for m the middle of July. One of them includes the Sapphire 3 experiment, the third in this installment of a spacecraft fire experiment. This is a controlled um, a uh, hard piece of hardware that stays on Cygnus, and once Cygnus departs and is safely away from the International Space Station, um, the Sapphire f f experiment actually ignites a sample inside of this piece of hardware. Sapphire 3 is sort of a reiteration of the first Sapphire experiment that uh, ignited uh, one, one large piece of a cotton and uh, fiberglass blend. On the second Sapphire experiment, they ignited uh, several smaller samples. But for Sapphire 3, they will ignite the, a sample similar to the one on Sapphire 1, except they'll ignite it um, with a different, uh, a higher velocity of a flame. Again, on the common berthing mechanism, there are uh, four gangs of four bolts, 16 bolts in total. There are two stages of capture. On that second stage of capture will be the official berthing. We'll make sure to release that time. And just receiving confirmation of second stage capture, uh, 16 bolts now driven and uh,
berthing of the Cygnus cargo vehicle to the International Space Station is complete at uh, 7.39 a.m. Central Time, 8.39 a.m. Eastern.